What is up everybody, it's your boy Duty back again with another video and this time we're taking a look at our boy DSP's daily rap after his Oblivion playthrough which did not turn out so well for our boy. Of course, Oblivion is not bringing the boys to the yard and the tips are lacking and our boy Phil sees it. So uh, I can picture Oblivion kind of being uh, set aside for new playthroughs coming up eventually. Anyway, let's see what our boy DSP has to say and also I have a special treat for you guys. So hang in to the end of the video. I wanted to show you some artwork that I received from our boy uh, Dark Seed to Phil. Uh, I commissioned some artwork and I'm going to use it kind of as an intro for my channel and I think it's pretty dope. So definitely want to share that so stick to the end. Let's see what Phil has to say. Good evening everyone and welcome to the Daily Wrap for what was Monday the 13th of February 2023 which I like to call Big Progress Day because pretty much on everything that I did today we made some pretty big progress. You know we started off with the level one podcast in the morning. We recapped <clears throat> all the fun announcements that I released on Sunday regarding my new YouTube channel DSP Reacts which if you didn't hear yet youtube.com forward slash at DSP Reacts you know the at symbol DSP Reacts check it out brand new channel couple videos up there to explain the premise of what it is okay the podcast today thoroughly discussed that and basically I started taking in different feedback from viewers on things such as G we're gonna do a new weekly show that's gonna be me reacting to clips from all over the internet what day should we do it or what time slot should we do it and stuff like that i even posted up live polls and things that people could vote on over on dsp reacts for that kind of input also <clears throat> i posted up three uh threads over the course of the day by which members over at dsp reacts can start nominating the videos they want me to react to on that next show later this week so lots of progress lots of fun there on the first stream then we jumped into Hogwarts Legacy, and Hogwarts Legacy again had lots of good progress today. Let me tell you, unlock the broom, did some races on the broom, which is really cool. I actually like the broom travel in the game. The graphics are amazing that it can load the map as fast as it does with literally no delay. You just, you're flying this open world and everything is just generating right there on the fly. Pretty crazy. Um, we unlocked a ton of new spells because we were doing a lot of side content missions for the teachers, but those unlock spells that are critical to the game. So we got a ton of new spells. I did my first base takeover against a bunch of uh, goblins. Um, I, there's a lot more that happened. Oh, the, the room. there's a room that you unlock in this game. <clears throat> I think it's called the Room of Requirements. Basically, it's a room where when you go in there, you can have your own crafting station set up. You can decorate the room however you want. It, it serves a lot of purposes. We did the whole setup for that, and I even upgraded it and started growing, uh, you know, monsters, like monster plants and crafting potions. Really good progress, like solid progress towards advancement in the game today uh, of Hogwarts Legacy. So, great fun there, and also outstanding support on that stream. Thank you to everyone who helped out and supported it. Late stream tonight was the return of Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion. Yes, a fun, chill Oblivion stream. Originally, I wasn't sure I was going to be able to do it this week, but I was able to, and I'm happy. It was super fun. Everyone was chill. And what did we do tonight? Dark Brotherhood. Exclusively Dark Brotherhood. Everything we did tonight was a Dark Brotherhood quest line. Um, and it went really well. We actually completed the entirety of the first major quest line and started doing the secondary missions. Sorry, I just the, <laughs> the focus just went off on the camera there. Um, and it went really well. Like, particularly well. Um, had a lot of fun. Ended up getting a new armor set that I actually really like and has a lot of good stat boosts. Um, my water walking boots helped me escape from assassinations multiple times. It was really funny, really cool. So, uh, I had a great time. And I hope that everyone else did. You know, support was alright for a late stream. Not gonna complain. Everything went well. Again, everything I did today was great progress. Alright? Now, tonight, I'm going... You notice that little whatchamacallit where he said, where he said, uh, support was okay, it was alright. And then he, he, he mentions how everything went well. And it just clearly shows that, again, like I've always stated over and over again, that Phil measures everything based on support and tips. And last night's Oblivion stream wasn't that great. I think he got 42 bucks. And if you wouldn't have even got that, uh, somebody stepped in, I think he gave 20 bucks uh, for the playthrough. So, I mean, he would have been looking at nearly 20 bucks of support. And of course, no memberships and uh, a couple super chats but it was not just a good day for phil so um it should be interesting this week i know he's planning to play hogwarts every day i think to the mainstream and uh i i have a feeling this may get the god of war treatment where uh support will just start weaning down and 
of course he'll 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 complain and talk about how great the game is and he has a lot of fun and everyone's having a lot of fun and people are there and engaging so he doesn't understand why support is lagging and that should be very interesting to hear so let's keep going to see what else he has to say to, well, oh, by the way, I also uploaded a YouTube short here. If you didn't see it, it was uh, in relation to my reaction to British Cuisine Part 2. Because I did one earlier this week. It's By the way, it's for comedic purposes. It's not meant to be taken seriously. So if you live in Great Britain, please don't take offense. It's just me joking about British Cuisine, okay? Uh, so it's the second part. It's a second short focusing in on that same very same topic from a couple days ago. So give it a look. Um... By the way, now that he's doing the DSP React channel, the shorts, that, that stuff's going to die off. He, he He's not going to do much of that. Uh, the only reason why he's doing it now is because he has one of his dents that actually pull, pulls the um, the videos and, and edits for him. That, that's why he's doing it. But uh, I started doing shorts. <clears throat> and I got a good amount of them and I got some views, man. But the ad revenue is just dog terrible it's, it's not good at all like it's very like typically for like a video that you post you get about eight dollars per thousand views that's kind of like what the average is for uh short it's like not even a dollar i think it's like it's it's like maybe 79 cents or maybe a dollar or whatever so it's not a lot so you have to get like millions of views just to make some money on it and I'm guessing that what that is is that they just have YouTube hasn't been able to sell ads yet for shorts. It just hasn't caught on like TikTok does and, and, and so on. Uh, and that may grow, but again, channels, small channels like myself and, and Phil and stuff, they're, <coughs> excuse me, they're not going to, excuse me, they're not going to really benefit from shorts. It's, it's just something that, that it's, it's it's good to do it. I mean, the benefit will be that you may get some eyes on your channel. But if you're thinking of making a living on it, it's, it's just not going to work out. Also, I would say we have potential for at least one to two more shorts from tonight's Oblivion stream. So we'll see if I can get those together for you. Okay? Um, also tonight, after I'm done recording this, I'm actually going to make my first ever YouTube short for DSP Reacts. Basically just promoting the fact that there is a new thread where the poll is up to vote on the day you want to see DSP versus the internet. And to announce to the members, hey, all those threads are now live for members only to nominate videos for that uh, next episode coming up. So that'll be nice to get a new, uh, a new short over there. I haven't done any shorts for that channel yet. Already the channel has almost like 16, 1700 new subscribers and climbing, which is pretty crazy. Actually, no, Phil. What it was was on your first day, you had, you had about 800 people there, and no lie, at least 700 were, were trolls and detractors just coming in to just make fun of you. And they subscribed because they had to subscribe to your channel to be able to talk. Uh, so you probably got a few hundred new subs to this channel, and they're probably the dents that are from DSP Gaming. People are apparently liking the idea and subbing to it, so that's awesome. Um this man has no self-awareness whatsoever. I mean, if he went back and looked at the stream, again, the vast majority of the people that were on the stream chatting were detractors. I mean, everyone was out in full force, just harassing Phil and just making fun of him. Uh, and the only people that were there were probably the two or 300 people that were, um, that usually follows his streams. And the vast, the rest of them, again, were just detractors there trying to just, you know, clown fail and, and so on because they knew it was going to be free reign to chat and, and, and do whatever on the streams what you'll end up seeing is like always you'll see a dip in a week or so when people start unsubbing once they get um once they get uh banned or you know or blocked from the channel they'll just unsub so it'll just go back to its normal support or normal numbers um all right tomorrow is my final consecutive streaming day of the week what a week it's been it's been a great week right Tomorrow it's more Hogwarts Legacy in the morning and One Piece Odyssey on the late stream where we're heading into the next memoriam of the game, meaning the next uh, memory of a major plotline in the anime that they've already been through. Uh, I'm not sure what it's going to be. I'm excited to see what it is because I've really enjoyed it up to this point. I had a great time with the game. So I hope you guys will join me for that tomorrow. All right, final day of the week. Thank you all. Great streaming day. Great progress. Great fun. Thank you and have a good night. See you in the AM. Peace out. Okay, well that wasn't very interesting, but whatever. All right, so now to the very interesting stuff. So let me just get myself situated here. Let me pick it out. 
Bam, what do you see there? What do you see there? You know what? I'm actually gonna go to a bigger view so you guys can actually see it better. Oh my lord, what do you see there? Do you see your boy, Darth Duty? That's right, Darth Duty in effect, chasing our boy DSP and vanquishing the evil that is the gout man. <laughs> so big ups to uh, Darcy uh, the Phil. I had actually commissioned uh, to have this done. I saw what he did with Aqua Teal's uh, picture and it was really cool in his inner animation. So I said, hey man, can you know, uh, here's some money. Can you do me something? And he was like, yeah, sure. So if you guys didn't watch, he had a video where he was kind of putting this together for me. Uh, definitely go check out his channel and sub to his channel. He, he does some really cool streams where he does artwork and he kind of talks about the process. And it's very, very cool. So big ups to Dark Seed and Phil. So here it is right here. This is kind of my channel art. So that's your boy Duty right there with his cup head. Uh, this is a lightsaber fly swatter. <laughs> and then you can see my probe droids, but essentially they're cups. Uh, you know, following uh, our boy BSP uh, here. So uh, let me hit play. You'll actually see some animation. There is no uh, music or anything yet. I'm gonna attach some really cool music to it. Uh, I got someone I know that's gonna put something really cool together. So hopefully, I'll have a very cool intro uh, happening. So here it is. Yep, so it's about 30 seconds of a running loop. I'm gonna modify it a bit. I'm just gonna have it where you see me up in the air and him running. And then what I'll probably do is I'll probably, I'll probably add a tag of my name, uh, Duty Streams, and then I'm gonna attach some music to it. So uh, I'm trying to go with like a Star Wars theme music, but you know, it's really tough for copy, copyright and stuff. So, but I'll either do that or uh, maybe I'll use the, I'll use the dog uh, uh, video created by uh, Maricat. I mean, the, the, the song created by Maricat, he actually gave me permission to use it. So maybe I'll do a combination of that. So that might be my intro for a good amount of my videos. Uh, just wanted to share that with you guys. It's really cool. Big up to Darcy, uh, Darcy the Phil. Uh, you can reach him on Twitter or YouTube. He actually does commissions. So if you want something for yourself, uh, he can just do pictures, animation, whatever the case is. He does amazing work. He's very reasonable and he works with you and he's a really good, uh, really good dude. So shout out uh, to Darcy the Phil. If you, if you are looking for something like this, he's the guy to go to. All right, fellas. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Peace out.